you hear today that they have arrested another American with alleged ties to al-Qaeda? This time it's a 26-year-old natural-born U.S. citizen from New Jersey, a man named Sharif Mobley. Authorities in Yemen saying he was arrested this month in a security sweep of al-Qaeda suspects in Sana, which is the capital city of Yemen. The Yemeni embassy in Washington today says that while he was still in custody in Yemen, the man complained this past weekend that he felt sick. When he was taken to a hospital, he reportedly grabbed a gun off of a security guard at the hospital, shot and killed one guard, and shot and wounded another. Mr. Mobley was then recaptured, and we learned about his arrest today. There are three things to know about this. First, he is accused of having links to the branch of al-Qaeda in Yemen, which is the group that's also linked to the Christmas Day failed underwear bomb attack. Second thing, like the kid in the underwear bomb attack, and like Major Nadal Hassan, the Fort Hood shooter, this newly arrested American guy is also said to have been in contact with a man named Anwar al-Awlaki. He's a radical American cleric who lives somewhere in Yemen. He claims to um, be involved with, uh, he, 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 there have been, these three different suspects have been said to be in contact with this man, and this man uh, seems to have quite the Rolodex. Uh, the, the final thing here that is important about this case, it's maybe the most worrying thing. Did you see this headline today? Suspected militant worked at nuclear plants. So in addition to being a U.S. citizen with a U.S. passport in touch with a radical cleric who seems to have inspired lots of attacks and attempted attacks on the United States, this guy also appears to have worked at nuclear power plants here for at least six years. He worked at three nuclear plants in New Jersey as a relatively low-level laborer, the alleged al-Qaeda kid at the nuclear plant. A law enforcement official telling the AP today that they think the nuclear plant job was unrelated to his alleged al-Qaeda job. So there's that. Sharif Mosley's father in New Jersey today was asked by reporters to comment on his son's arrest in Yemen. He said, I can tell you this, he's no terrorist. We will keep you posted on this case.